Minecraft is a heaven for modders. There are literally thousands of mods available for the game and some of them can help you talk to your friends. My name is Adullah. You're watching Candid or Technology and in this video we're talking about the simple voice chat mod for Minecraft. How you can install it, how you can use it and how you can set it up. So the first thing that we need to get the mod running is to have a mod chain. Now, uh, this doesn't matter if you can use CurseForge, you can use uh, uh, any one that you like. I am going to demonstrate this with Fabric. So if you don't have any mod chain or mod tool install, installed for uh, Minecraft, you can try and start off with Fabric. It's extremely easy. The link for this page will be in the description below. But once you get to the Fabric download page, you will see uh, this download for Windows button. Or if you're on Linux or if you're on Mac OS, uh, you will see your corresponding windows you can also download a universal jar and go ahead with that but for that i'm just going to go ahead with the download for windows button this will uh download an installer so we go ahead and save that and then we are going to download simple voice chat now you can find this on curseforge so uh as you can see this is the whole thing it's uh you can get this on forge neoforge quilt velocity bungee cord in a bunch of places Essentially, what we're going to do is once you get on this page, once again, link in the description below, head over to files and then you will see a bunch of different files here. You need to get the correct file corresponding to your uh, mod loader version and Minecraft version. So since I'm using fabric and my Minecraft version is 1.2, 1.4, this is what we're going to use. So just go ahead and then click on download file. This is going to take a little bit to download. One second, download should start any minute now. All right, yeah, so as you can see, this is a jar file that's going to save. And uh, this should be complete. So now that you have uh, Fabric and Voice Chart uh, installers downloaded, we're going to go ahead to Windows Explorer to the folder where I installed both of these things. So as you can see, we have both a Voice Chart and Fabric installer. So double click on this one first, give it a second to load up. All right. And uh, now it should automatically pick up everything that uh, your Minecraft is about. So it should automatically get this launcher location as long as you have installed Minecraft in the default location. Loader version, uh, don't touch this one. Uh, just make sure you have selected the right Minecraft version here as well and that you've downloaded the correct uh, simple voice chat plugin version for this as well. Uh, check the create profile box. This should so ready to install. So we go ahead and click on install and wait for this to finish. You do need to have an internet connection uh, when the installation is running because it downloads some files. And uh, once this is done, you should uh, see this message. So go ahead and click on OK. And we are good to go. All right. So now what do we need to do is uh, the file that we downloaded for simple voice chat this jar file we need to place it in the app data folder or the folder where you put our minecraft mods so to do this press windows key plus r to open up the run prompt and type in percentage app data percentage press enter in here find the dot minecraft folder and you should have a mods section in it so we're going to go ahead and double click this and this should be empty. So what we're going to do is we're going to simply drag and drop this file into our Minecraft folder or Minecraft mods folder. And uh, yeah, that's it. That's all you really need to do to, in order to get simple voice chat running. So once this is done, uh, let's go ahead and fire up our Minecraft launcher. Give it a second to load. All right, now, uh, as you can see, you should be able to see your fabric loader version here. So this is my uh, vanilla version of Minecraft, if you will. And then this will be my fabric loader. As you can see, this installation has been modified and might not support latest player safety features and other nada. If not, you can come to installations and then you can see it right here as well. So go ahead and click on play. Uh, it will tell you that it's modified and you can't guarantee that play will be safety and everything. So you can just ignore that. Go ahead and click on play. We'll wait for Minecraft to launch now. As you can see, it should download some files uh, that are required for the plugins and everything else to run properly. 
Now this will require a server that is using simple voice chat and the correct loader and the correct versions for everything to work. But uh, for the sake of a demonstration, I'm just going to show this to you in a local world. And here we are. So now if we head over to options, then controls and then keybinds and scroll all the way down, you should see some voice chat options. And if you see them here, this means you're pretty much done setting up a simple voice chat that's all you need to do and then this is the v key or the voice chat menu and then you can uh, have different binds for uh, to toggle voice chat on and off you can have a push talk key uh, and everything else so uh, just keep in mind that the main voice chat menu is by default opens with v this is what we need to do so we go back uh, let me just fire up my test world and here we are so as you can see there is already a message from simple voice chat right at the bottom that tells us what we need to do there are some artifacting going on which is a little bit weird but if i press v this will show you how to set up simple voice chat and this will only uh, come up if you're doing it for the first time so for the sake of simplicity let's go through this uh, go ahead and click next this will first ask you to select your microphone. I'm using a Razer Siren Mini. So we're going to go ahead with that. Then click next. Then it's going to ask you to select your speakers. Uh, select your speaker or your headphones, whatever you want. Go ahead and click next again. Uh, now this wants a method of activation. So as in the case with every game, you can either push a key to talk. And as long as you're holding a button, holding that particular button, you will your voice will be able to uh, your voice will reach everybody else and then there is voice activation so just like on discord it automatically directs your voice and uh, push place that on the server so i'm just going to go ahead with voice activation for now then here are some noise suppression settings so how much you want your voice to be amplified uh, if it's not if you're not loud enough for other people when you're talking you can use the setting you can have noise suppression if you're in a sort of busy area like a gaming cafe or something and then uh, there is a voice activation threshold so how much voice your mic should get before it starts transmitting it to everybody else in minecraft so simply go ahead and adjust this as you want uh, keep in mind the lower this uh, the higher this number the lower sound the plugin needs in order to be able to turn your mic on so you're going to have to play around with this especially if you're going with the uh, voice activation method and then you can use this button to check your microphone so as you can see i can adjust this threshold accordingly to make sure that uh, my voice is probably heard and I can even get this all the way down and zero decibel will deactivate the microphone, of course. But uh, you can have it set up properly. Uh, if you go too high, it, you're going to have to literally shout into your microphone to be able to hear anything. But uh, I, you can set it to somewhere like 50 or 60 decibel and uh, you should be able to get most of your voice through. So I can just uncheck this, go ahead and click on next and that's it simple voice chat has now been set up uh you can press the m key to unmute of course you can go ahead and change those binds as well click on finish setup and now as you can see i have a small mic appearing on my minecraft screen why is that that is because i'm currently muted so if i press the m key as you can see now i am transmitting voice i can press it again to mute and now if i press v voice chat settings show up so if you go to settings you have your chat volume you have uh, you have the global chat volume you have your microsoft amplification you have noise suppression you have your activation method you can switch it to push to talk or method uh, voice however you want 3d audio you can just let that be uh, you can select your microphone and speakers and then you can adjust individual volumes for everyone on the server uh, you can disable all voice chat you can mute yourself you can adjust volumes once again for everybody involved and finally you can also record audio so if you're recording your game and you need it to record you can hide all voice icons using this button and you can start recording one final feature they need to about is groups so groups are a lot about like parties in multiplayer games anybody who is in a particular group can hear each other and nobody else outside of the group will be able to hear them so you can create a new group uh, let's say test group 
and you can even set a password and uh, you can have it open or you can have it isolated so people in your group cannot hear you and you cannot hear them there's a normal group type so people who are not in your group can't hear you but you can hear them and then there is an open group so pe- players who are not in your group can hear you and you can hear them as well so uh, mostly a g- normal group type will be good to go so go ahead and click on create and then there is this test group and you can uh, either hide or view the group hard and then you can add more people to it you can leave the group using this so as you can see in the top right corner now i have uh, everybody who is in my group will appear right there and uh, that's it that's how easy it is to set up and install simple voice chat on minecraft if you like this video consider subscribing give us a thumbs up press the bell icon and tell us in the comments below what more such videos can we make for you if you'd like to know more about tech visit our website candid.technology follow us on social media follow me on instagram or twitter and we'll see you in the next video